How come you're so tired? Who, me? <laughs> oh, I don't know. <laughs> Been doing nothing all day, right? I know. Wow. Happy Saturday. It's very chilly today. Very chilly, but all the dogs did well. They're all happy in their new spots. Um, let's see. Rue was good today. She's a little distracted. We went to Tractor Supply and we saw lots of dogs, so that was good. Very distracting, but she was really good. She wanted to just stare at them, but took a few times and then she was great. Just needs to, she's a poop, so she just needs to focus more. Um, and then Kanga and I went to Big Lots. She was good. Forget what. Oh, we needed, we took a lot of time on working on bracing from a chair. Because she just wanted to lick my face and climb all over me. Um, so we took a long time to settle with that. And then we did it a few more times and she was good. But she just, she's so happy. And then Oreo and I went to the dollar store. It was like, the dollar store on a Saturday, I guess, is like Walmart on a Saturday. There was a lot going on. But he handled it like a champ. I was struggling. <laughs> um, it was so crazy busy and there were tons of crazy people. Was the sound on? Or am I just delayed? I hope. Yeah. I think. Yeah. Let me. Yeah, yeah we're just yeah. a little yeah, delayed. All right. Okay. Um. Jagger was perfect today, as usual. He was a good boy. He was good. I brought him to the gym on Thursday, and he was perfect then too. He was funny. He was so good that I forgot he was there, so I went to walk away around the corner. And I came back and Judy was like, oh, I told him to lie down. And I was like, what do you mean? I was like, oh, my God, I forgot about him. <laughs> so he went to find me, but he listened to Judy, so he was good. He likes it. He's a good boy. And there were two little kids there with their waiting for their parents, and he was just, the little boy was laying down on his iPad, and Jagger was just like, what is he? Like, what's he doing? But he was good with them. He was cute. Um, Pluto and I went to Home Goods. How was she? She was good. She's a little, she can be a little funny. Um, we're working on touching her more because she doesn't like, she's very weird about like her touching her scruff and poking at her toes and stuff. So she's in the barn to be touched. Um, the rest of the comets are all in Deagle House. They all seem pretty happy up there with their big fields to run in. Um, Sorry. Rabbit, are you bored? Are you still bored? Want to go back to the barn tomorrow morning? I'll get you out of here. Tomorrow, I'll get you out of here. Um, yeah, Pluto did well. She was nervous in the bathroom, but she did well. Who else did I do? Brigal, we went to Crosby's. Um, it's a good grocery store, but it's also quiet, so it's good for them to get used to the grocery store. Um, she just needs some more confidence. All the Comet ladies kind of take after their mom. They all need to work on their confidence. They're also little, too. Leo's a tank, but he's short they're all really short and the girls have, are all muscular and skinny definitely look like laney and gromit they're definitely gromit laney puppies um but yeah leo's he's short but he's big tanky kind of man um bentley resting i think he ate today he did eat today he's feeling better i think um what else can i tell you any questions Tigger was here today. He has a lot of fun with Rue. A lot of the girls get annoyed with him because he's just, he's a lot to play with. But they do well together. They had uh, access to Ice Hill all day, so he had fun. Did they get the tree out of the decor? Yes. Um, Keegan worked on fixing that fence and getting the tree out. Um, he had a lot of stuff to do today, but he did, he did that. So that's all better now, I think. He was like, I found one hole, as I said. I think there's a few, but as long as you found a few, because Rabbit was in there, um, I think it was last week, and she was digging holes under all the fences. But they're all better now, which is good. Good, good, good. Any questions? Anything? Anything? <laughs> Nothing for me? Anything? Anything? You got anything good to say? What? Do you have anything good to say? Really good, no. <laughs> no, try me again tomorrow. Okay, I'll try tomorrow. All right.
a lot of good stuff too. I hope you're all using the water bottles I washed. Not you yet. Know about I washed my own. I saw the covers. We're going to run out of those little ones, you know, and I'm not buying any more. <laughs> got it. You got it. Uh, oh, there's just one. It disappeared. There you go. Oh, where'd it go? It disappeared. There was a car that didn't ask. Do you have trouble not buying things at all the stores? Um, I usually leave my wallet in the car so I don't buy stuff. Um, but yeah. Not usually. If I leave it in the car, then I'm good. But. They have new, a lot of them is new stuff every day, which is nice because we're in there all the time. So, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. how's the room here in daily bathroom stall? Um, we use the handicap stall. Um, sometimes we have to swish into the little one if someone's in there. Um, some of the dogs are good at that. Um, yeah, we wait for the handicap stall, so we fit nicely in there. Um, any other questions? Anything? Anything at all? Mm -hmm. oh. How is Happy Tails doing? Um, Honey is healing, and then we have no other ones right now, which is nice. It's weird not having blood everywhere. Um, but yeah, Honey's, she's healing. She's still in Ice House. Um, Winnie's is all better, and Jagger's is all good. And Kanga's hasn't opened up again, so still doing good. Still doing good there, which is good. Your turn. My turn? Your turn. Our turn, yeah. Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. I'm coming. Okay, he's coming. <laughs> he's coming. Well, I could open this one early. This ought to be fun. This ought to be fun. <clears throat> While I wait for Steve to settle. This could be... Could take a while? Could be a while. This is the guy from the marathon deal. Oh, uh, what the? I don't know. I haven't turned it over yet. Did you want me to have it? Yeah. I had to look at the envelope, see what I missed. People are curious. Let's go. Okay, we work on it. Hundred dollars. Oh, what's he doing? Oh, it's an it, 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 app, application. I didn't think that was anywhere near as much fun. I want you to run the marathon next year. <laughs> that was the marathon episode. With the dogs. <clears throat> My God, they did a formal job of it. Well, isn't that impressive? Okay. Okay, we'll put that in for Linda to deal with. Because it's very confusing, the whole thing. I'll get my own bottle. Because nobody got it for me. Oh, oh, is it really that tough to reach? It's hard. Oh, well, it's hard. I'll tell you why it's hard, since you asked. I, 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 Ever since I, really, I went to I really want to know. Come on. <laughs> Ever since I went to school with those damn puppies... My shoulders never recovered. Oh, don't talk Hanging to on to those, they were they were tough. And I was in that wheelchair. You try and hold on to puppies in a wheelchair. You know, well, it was it was a very difficult assignment. That'll teach you. You're right. I won't do that again. Oh, I can spell. I get tired. Okay, this is Richard Lamb, Johnstown, Pennsylvania. Here we go. Thank you. Here we go. Oh my heavens. Okay. We select a charity each year to raise money for 
our winery. This year we wanted to raise money to help a veteran get a service dog and close the $7 check from our winery and also VFW sent an additional $100. The money was raised at our annual chili cook-off. Well, isn't that fun? Which winery Send is it? the chili. Jeez. Okay, this is B-R-I-U-O-L-O, -L -L, Family Wines, Johnstown, Pennsylvania. Can I copy the name off the... Um... Sure. Be very... Oh, there it is. B&L Wine Cellars. 900 Broad Street, Johnstown, Pennsylvania. All you winos out there want to order wine? Go get some. <laughs> well, gee, that was a nice way to put it. That's right. My sister drinks wine. I don't drink wine. I need brandy. <laughs> Everyone's got their preference. There'll be a slight delay while he types it in. You can keep going. Don't wait for me. Well, you got the check. I want to put the I'll check give, in I'll here. I'll give it back to you. Well, I got to put it in here. B and L Wine Cellars, 900 Broad Street. There you go. Johnstown, Pennsylvania, 15906. Thank you very much. Okay. Next problem. Jose Perez, Tampa, Florida. The name I've seen before. A name I've seen before, and they would like five chicken bricks. Is that the sun out there? I don't know. I'm a stranger. Is that, is that the sun? Is that the sun, or does something blow up? Here comes the sun. Okay, Lucy Lou, Wharton, New Jersey. Lucy Lou. There you go. Thank you. Lucy Lou, just like it sounds. For chicken breasts. Wow. Thanks, Evan. Thought I would continue my Christmas theme by using red envelopes. They're the only stamps that were handy in Santa stamps. Please use the attached check for 10 chicken bricks. I enjoy wow. checking out Thank all you. the Servant Door Project daily. Love, Connie who's also known as Lucy Lou. Well, thank you very thank much. You. She gets chicken bricks, and that goes in there, and then that I goes in there. How do you get Connie out of Lucy Lou? You need to tell us that one. What? She needs to, how do you get Connie out of Lucy Lou? Oh, oh. I'm curious. Are well, you, you curious? Work, you work on that project. All right, you work on that. Lucy, if you're watching, you really want to know. <laughs> Her name is Lucy. Harold Wanda. <laughs> Lucy. Harold Wanda. Wanda. Now that's more like it. <laughs> that was a good one. That was a good one. Did we hear you over there? Yeah. Okay. Okay. <coughs> and a beacon. Okay. We did that part. Oh, I'm going to leave that there. Might need that. Oh, I can't even type. Okay. I'm in trouble with the e, e pass again. Where on earth? I don't what know what you do The e pass. That. Funny thing in my, you don't want that. I don't want that. Uh, what have I done now? Eleven dollars and forty-five cents. Why the hell? I, I don't ever say. Well, payments and credits. I did pay the two dollars and fifteen cents. Where on earth? Why ten dollars eighty-five cents? Where'd I go? I didn't do that. Thanks a lot. I would double check that because they make a lot of errors. The mass DOT. No. I didn't go anywhere. <coughs> Who's been driving my car? I'm not here, so don't look at me. <laughs> I can look at the Hopkins, and that's not a toll road. Did you go out? You didn't go out on the turnpike, did you? No. 495. I haven't been anywhere. It doesn't say where they... <coughs> You know, all this, all this automation, they ought to be able to tell me where I went. I, I, I didn't know. Is my, I'm not even sure that's my license plate. Anybody know what my license plate number is? 
I'm, I'm terrible. Is that my license plate? I don't know. You should take a picture of it and have it on your phone. Lila Maid wants to know if an applicant is not considered to re <laughs> receive a service dog, is that fee returned? But there's no fee for the service dog. It's just a donation. Uh, there is an application fee of 25 bucks. I not stand corrected. You stand corrected. <clears throat> there's no fee for sending in an inquiry. If we ask you for a full application, that's $25. And we only do that to stop people from, you know, make people stop and think a little bit. You're getting a dog worth about $25,000 if you are accepted. If you're not accepted, there's nothing we can do about it. Uh, it's and it's the a game. dog is free. That there's no charge for the dog. No, no charge for the dog. Right. Okay. Mailed in the hat on Thursday, the twenty fifth. There you go. Thank you. And this is for chicken bricks. Okay. That goes in there. And this is from Jan Gerhold. Jan Gerhold. Mailed on the 24th from I don't know where. Where's she from? Mishawaka. Oh, geez. Okay, Mishawaka. We got one from her yesterday, too. Mishawaka you get one all the time. Okay, and then that goes in here, and then she has things. Once in a while, someone amazing comes along, and here I am. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Snapple fact. Strawberries are the only fruit whose seeds grow on the outside. Oh, that's right. I knew that. Is that true? That's interesting. I don't know. I don't know that it's wrong. It is what it is. Get over it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. We'll do that. The, the queen of understatement. Oh, that's a bill from Medicare. Well, I'll tell everybody what it is so that everybody knows oh, what's yeah, happening. Yeah, yeah. I have Medicare and MedEx. I don't know why, but that's what I've always had. Oh, geez. Here, here it is written in Russian. I'm glad they've got that under control. We'll all start learning it. Okay. Oh, I see. No, this isn't a bill. This is every pill I've taken in the last month. <laughs> Well, this is always a good one, too. Yeah, well, you, you might want to keep that one personal. <laughs> okay, no, this, i got to share this oh, with everybody. Geez. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> Your year-to-date out-of-pocket costs is $373.53, and my plan paid $23.77. <laughs> Do you want me to read those numbers again? <laughs> His plan, which cost me I don't know what, right. paid $23.00. <laughs> And for some unknown reason, I had to pay 373 <coughs> And I, I'm too lazy to read the details. But that's just, it is what it is. You've got to just, you know? So get over it. <laughs> well, I think it's a waste of time to read the directions. I have one medication that my insurance company was giving me grief about. They pay... I have to pay a forty dollar copay <coughs> for when I have the ins when the insurance is paying. For. Medicare? No, it's uh, private. Oh, through my employer. And it costs me forty seven dollars to pay it out of pocket. Oh boy. So they're only paying seven dollars. Wow. Yep. Yep. Amazing. They wanted me to go to mail order, and I said I don't want to do mail order. I just don't want to. Do it. Well, I, I don't think I have to even have that. Jennifer, Long Beach, California. I'm actually saving three dollars a month by buying it out of pocket from the pharmacy. Oh, amazing! Okay. It's crazy. Yes. Jennifer from Long Beach, California. Yep. Thanks for all you do. Great group of volunteers and staff. You got that all? Did you hear that? Yay! Yay! Yay. Magnificent results and such joy to watch the cameras and see how this service dog changed lives. <coughs> they closed the check for 20 either at the farm or behind the scenes. First two bricks, please. Give to Scooter Karen, who's not only with wonderful things at the farm, but provides CPs with wonderful weekly 
Picks and recaps. So appreciated. Okay, so she gets two. And the rest get a round. Oh, she's also my friendly CPAP filter reminder person. See, everybody around here has a job. This person's job is to remind me to replace my CPAP filter. Right? Are you listening? So right. You're not paying any attention. Hey, did the... Um, I have a box. I, I understand, but I have a question. Oh. Um, I had emailed you that there was a bench coming that was donated by... Yeah, it's out there. Oh, it, it is. Okay, great. Okay. Just want to check. Cause, um, I think. Two pieces came out there. We never opened them in here. Okay. All right. Um, all right. I may move those down to the meat shack. That would probably be a good idea. Yeah. I'll leave them Plant down them. there, and then next time I'm here, I'll, I'll assemble it. Okay. Now okay. can I have my boxes? Yeah. Now you can have your box. After I see who it's from. Jay Dreeble. Hang on. Keep it just... New York, New York. Are you ready? I'm ready. Here you go. There you are. Oh, there we go. That's a light one. Enough complaints about the weight of the. I don't know. Whoop. Oh, no, it's a light one. This one. Oy vey. Oy vey. I just discovered, as I was trying to find where I was supposed to go today, that there is a store in Ipswich that sells ammunition and guns and things. Never knew it was there. It's way in the back corner of a small shopping center. Probably a good place for it. Somehow I'm shocked. Well, I also wondered if it was, if you could vote that out of town. I mean, you could certainly bring it up with your town reps, but I, I don't know. I don't know. Because if everybody, if everybody fusses about it, is that one way of? Yeah, but then what's to stop people from? Oh, well, there would be nothing to stop them, but it would, it would, if we got going, that'd be good. Mm -hmm. Dear Carlene, some fluffies for your beautiful Danes, and some Indian dishes that I hope you will enjoy. Oh. oh, boy. Jar of blackberry jam to make your toast of mud. <laughs> Good. Thank you for the wonderful <laughs> existence of Service Dog Project. And the fluffies are washed. Washed. She, she didn't put an R in there yet, though. No. <laughs> but she's close. Here, you want those? Yeah, sure. pass them along to me. Eileen likes those. Did you have another one? Here's the one. Oh, my word. Look at that. Thank you. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, you'll look nice in that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's the jam. We got the jam. Right, right, right. Huh. Indian chickpeas. That's good. That's a good one. Here's another one. You got it? Got it. Black graham lentils curry. Here's another one. Great. What is it? In fact, we have no puppies to put on them. It's not my fault. <laughs> I don't know who you're going to blame that on, but here's the. Here's, and there's, there's bags in the bottom of there, too. Oh, boy. Okay, we did that. Now you're going to struggle with the heavy one, or what? I'm not even going to put this up there. It's going down here. Okay. Oh. You're welcome. Oh. I can put that on here. Oh, okay. You want me to put it up here? No, I'll well, struggle. Oh, it's from Laura. This way, and then it's not up there. It's up there. Is this Laura? Yep. Laura Huron? Huron. Huron. Ron. 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 I lost the opener. How did you lose it? I don't know. I didn't mean to lose it. I just had it. Oh, no, it's right there. There it is. Right behind the chickpeas. Just behind the chickpeas. There we go. Not too far. Oh, okay. Thank you. 
Wow! Yeah, we didn't know what was in there. I know, but it's always amazing to me. And, and we always go through them. There we go. Oh my goodness. Wow. She's actually Pat's solid. They're not bad if you want to try one. Can I just eat dog biscuits? Yeah. Tanner oh. and, and I have tested a few of them. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you have. Yeah. Looks really good. Yeah, okay. They're nice. They're nice. Ah. <laughs> How much does each one of these weigh? <laughs> I can get it out. No, I was going to see how many is in there. Two pounds. Two pounds, really? Two pounds. So how many is in that box? <laughs> Because it's the end of the day, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hey, so. be a nice foot rest for you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, no. You guys are dead asleep. Okay. Now what? Sizzle had a very healthy snack at the at the knee shack today. Did she? Yes. No wonder she doesn't eat. <laughs> <laughs> She don't want to see her eat her vegetables. She? And she went for a ride. She went for a ride. She was good? She was, she was good. Very good. Did you get, did she get the car when you told her to? Yes. She won't get in the back, though, because she gets, she doesn't get in the back of your car, right? right. I had, she won't go in the back, so I opened up the side and she went in. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, Rabbit. How can you Our dogs don't have commands. There. You talk to them. Yep. For God's sake, don't do that. You know, and she they don't attention to the food. <laughs> no, 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 pay no attention to the food whatsoever. Okay. She does bark at dogs along the street, She's though. Like that. Just a little bit. Yep. Grumbled. Didn't bark. She grumbled. Yeah. A little grumbled. What have we got? What have we got? <clears throat> we have. <clears throat> um. We already did that one. Who is in Annie's chair? <laughs> it's up to you. Would you like to introduce yourself? Yes, I'm Teresa. I'm from Cincinnati. I'll be here till Tuesday. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. Sometimes people don't like to be introduced to those oh. people. <laughs> Harold and Wanda, Harold and Wanda. Right, Joan has sent... Why are all the donkeys in the barn? It's going to rain tomorrow. They're reserving their place. I guess, yeah. They're yeah. making reservations. <coughs> They're in there. Um, Joan has sent you something that says lifter or leaner. And it's, Carlene, did you ever read the, the, this poem? It's written by Ella Wheeler Cox. She's the person that also had the poem with the words, laugh and the world laughs with you, oh, yeah. weep and you weep alone. You are most definitely a lifter, so <laughs> you might want to take a peek at that. Keep us remember it. Who's the, who's in the remembering department? I'll I'll yeah. email I'll email it to you. Okay. Harold wanna Harold wanna Harold wanna. Um, <laughs> I missed it. I was upstairs. No, oh, what? Harold. Oh, let's hear it. Harold. There we go. Okay. There we go. All right. Um, Jody from Maryland. Hi, Jody. Hey, Says, Jody. Your statement should tell you where you encountered the. The what? Where you encountered? I think she meant to say toll. She said where you encountered the tool. <laughs> okay. Okay. I have Easy Pass from Maryland, and I get a detailed statement each month. It tells me where I was charged and how much. Yeah. Don't you get a statement in your email? No. You should. You keep sending me these damn bills. You should check that. You can, yeah. I'm not sure that license plate's right. <laughs> well, you should check that. You you should have an online account. Like, you, you log into it. and you. I should have a lot of things. Well, you know, you want me to set that up for you? I'd be glad. First, let me show you my list of things that already have passwords. No, no, I don't want to. I've seen your that? password list. That's okay. There's one. That's two. There's three. You need to simplify that. Four, five, six, seven and a half. 
seven and a half spreadsheet things. I don't need no, no more. No you're always swearing at your computer. <laughs> I don't want to do it anymore. <laughs> Ever. All right, Blue. Dearest Caroline, APX. How many female dogs do you have either at STP or at other homes uh, okay. used, I, I, used, I just, used for breeding, and what's the longest time you've gone between having female dogs and heat for breeding? I just happen to have it already done. That's a good question. You want to go hold this up? All right. One, two. Stowe, Paula, no. May, Paula, Stowe, Sizzle, Reese, Mindy, Misha, Lady, and Gabby. Go ahead. Go hold it up. Probably <gasps> the other side. Turn it, baby. Oh, oh this way. That would, okay. yeah, that'd be better. <laughs> Uh, let's see, to get the whole thing in, probably like... And I had planned on Sizzle let me, and Tigger. Let me know if you can see it. And Stowe and Richard. I want Sizzle to go into heat. Well, I, got, I, <coughs> I got really donkeys. want her to have puppies. I got donkey asses. <laughs> well, they were all asses, but... <coughs> well, you just stand there for a while. Because <coughs> you're still sitting here. Do, 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 do. What was the other question? It's a dimension in time. How long have we gone? I don't know, but this seems to be a very long stretch of no puppies. It's a very long stretch of not showing the damn board. <laughs> well, you can sit down because it'll show for a long yeah, time. Yeah, but I want to make sure I get the whole thing on there. Oh, Would you come on? Hurry right up. there. Jeez, Louise. This could be a rewind, and we wouldn't know it. <laughs> you wear the I same give, hat all I the time up. anyway. Here, read it. <laughs> Oh, brother. Oh. I think there's one more. Is Lily available? What? Lily. What about Lily? <coughs> Is she also available as a breeder? Who's Lily? Lainey's daughter. Lily, Lily, oh, Lily. Pictures of Lily. Lily Bug? I don't know. Lily Bug. I have a Lily. I had a Lily way back here. Yeah, no, this is Lily Bug from Lainey. I don't, I have, I'm not on my list. Okay. Who's got Get her on the list. list. Um, what, what happened? Huh. Here we go. Now we're about to see if it's showed. <coughs> All right, here we finally. Jeez Louise. There you go. See, you got it. You, you got it. Hey, Gabby's the top one. Okay. All right. A little reflection on there, though. But you can see it. Hey. I get critiquing it. You just well, don't right there. I want to do you know, it. should be readable. I want it to be right. You know? Okay. Uh, keep, can we move on? <laughs> Cammy from California. Now I feel bad. I go pick up one medication and walk out the door. It doesn't cost me a penny, and I still can't figure that one out. Don't complain. Don't complain. <laughs> Swamp from Virginia, did, did I say the bench has arrived? Yes, it has. Annie's bench is here. The next time I am here, which is in a couple of weeks, I will put it together. <coughs> um, uh, Gail Freese, Mass Easy Pass charges for paper statements. If you check your account online, it's free. Hmm. I, I just only get mine online, so I, I don't know. But hmm. You probably can get on your account online and then just check. They're it. probably going to ask me what my license plate is. I obviously don't know that. Well, I will take a picture of it for you, and we'll get that. Don't worry. <laughs> B short says obviously the people aren't concerned about the gun store since there hasn't been an uproar about it. Oh, huh? the gun store. Oh, the gun store. No, I, I don't think anybody knows it's there. It's way back in the corner of a shopping center. Mm -hmm. You have to go really look for it. Punky from New York, how is Bentley feeling? I think he's better. Actually, he hasn't gone to the bathroom all day, so I think we plugged him up good. <laughs> and you know, after all these, well, after all these fancy medications that we had him on, you know, the flagell and the mid, I gave him two Pepto Bismols this morning, oh, and he was, and that's been fine. When we take the cork out. Let's do it outside. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> he's fine. I mean, he, he's acting fine anyway. He's eating and drinking. There's the other end that's been a little questionable. Joe Marcano, 
Hi, Steve. Always good when you're around. I like this guy. I like this guy. Just letting you know. I know why. Do you now shred the meat yourself? Yes, I am shredding the meat myself. Unless sometimes people that come to visit that have done it with me before will help also, but but yeah. I'll send more down your way. And no, it's good. I'm good. I got 10 done today, and I'm trying to build up the stock for when I'm going to be gone for a few weeks, and I have 36 in there right now in the freezer. Oh, good. Yeah. And the freezer's good. Yeah. I want to get up over 40, you know, probably next weekend I'll do that. So. That's another thing that I should tell everybody is anytime you're in the freezer, let's, let's make note of what the temperature is, shall we? Oh, I check it every time. It's, yeah, it's fine. It's but you're, fine. you're only here a couple times a week, but well, they're in there every day. Yeah, true. That's check true. the temperature. Make the door sure the door gets shut. Make out. sure. Yeah, uh, I had a sign on the door a while back to make sure the door is closed. But yeah, well, you can put up a thing next to it that says "Make sure you read the sign." <laughs> <laughs> That's about what you gotta do. Oh, honestly. Um, for Caroline, what kind of a day did you have today? You know, I get to this time of the day and I can't remember. <laughs> well, you drove around down there a lot in your car. I did. Okay. I was noticing things. Yes. That was my notice trip. Your notice trip. What did you notice today? I noticed that we really need to cut a drain through to let the water out of that field. Yeah, we have two new ponds. Mm. Yes. We have one in A field and the one down here. I mean, no. no, no, the A field. We and don't one, have one in A field anymore. He and, drained it. And one in flat field. This one? Down here? Oh, no, that's a, no, that one's a, It's huge. It is. Well, that's, that's normal. Okay. It's a field we had to get rid of. <laughs> just drill a hole in it. Well, he did. There was just a, a small bump that was catching the water. A couple shovelfuls let it out into the driveway, and then another couple shovelfuls got it into the damp area. The damp area? <laughs> <laughs> there were a lot of damp areas around here. At least but it's not a was, damp area where it's going to bother us. That looked like you could float a canoe in there this morning. I mean, it was... I know. It, was a it rained. And it's... I'm not to be the bearer of bad news, but it's, it's supposed to... There's supposed to be some rain every... For the next... Not next, but 11 out of the next 14 days. That's okay. I'm trying to grow grass. Well, it's growing. <laughs> it's growing. Yeah. Go for it, grass. <clears throat> Actually, the grass down by Puppy Hill looks good. Oh, yeah. If you stand good. back a little bit, it really is all green it's right now. that tall already. Yeah. I better worry about when I'm going to get delivery on the mower next, probably. Um, um, how, let's see. Something about Laura. Very generous, Laura, and happy birthday to you. Happy, um, Swarm, Cammy, happy birthday, uh, Laura. Uh, uh, um, Lila May, how is Linda Kay feeling? What's Linda Kay is sick. She didn't come in. What's wrong? Is she okay? She said she has bronchitis, whatever oh, that is. Oh, man. What's wow. about bronchitis? Well, <coughs> it's nasty. Well, yeah. Exactly. How's our food department? We're not done yet. <laughs> Jane Slade and the raspberry seeds are, are outside too, as are mulberries and blackberries. There you go. Thank you, Jane. Learn something. I saw every that. I didn't really know whether I agreed. Well, then we're going to get some then, and we're going to we're, we're going to find out we're because the out. seed is in that little bump. That's not really the seed. On a strawberry, it's the seed on the outside. On the raspberry, there's a bump. It's got a seed in it. All right, let's have some feedback. Guys. Now, we now we're going to have to define what's in and what's out. The weather is, is. We need pictures. <laughs> <laughs> Elaine from Ohio says, yay, Ohio. Yay, Ohio. <laughs> 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 ben Ward from New Jersey says, hi, Teresa from Cincinnati. Thank you for volunteering. Glad to be here. <laughs> Lila May, another Ohioan. Hi, Teresa. Um, Whenever you say Cincinnati, I think of whoever it is that's out there. She does a good job. I like her. Carol, Carol, and Clark. Yep. Clark yeah, yeah, and the yeah. dog. Yeah. I've actually seen them at PetSmart. 
Oh, really? Yep. <laughs> You've run into him? Yep. Looking good? It's been a while, but yeah. Good. He's a gorgeous dog. Yeah. He's a gorgeous dog. I hope some of the people who show dogs look at some of these dogs and think, oh, should be in the show ring. Mm -hmm. That's really not what I had in mind. And Carolyn takes such good care of him, oh. too. She's great. Yeah. Right. Tony Moy Polakowski, a kid from my hometown, Pittsburgh, PA, was drafted last night by the Patriots. Congrats, Chase Winovich. Awesome. I hope he's good. I won't get all excited about that until Tanner gets drafted at some place. Mm, yeah. But that'll be fun. We'll find out in a few he's years. He's tall enough. <laughs> Bunch of us have signed baseballs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Diane, 730. Hi, Carlene. Where do all the puppies go after they're weaned? They go nowhere. They hang around here. They're going... They grow and they grow and they grow. <laughs> they grow. Then they, they weigh 100 pounds and we grow. Depends we, on the size of the litter, too. And we feed they're... them. They grow some more. <laughs> <laughs> it's very educational. Keep going. No, so they get split up. Sometimes some of them go into um, Nut House. Yeah. And they, then they some get of them moved go around to Kennel 10. We move them around. Yeah, and they, they get shifted just for to have a change of scenery. And um, they start, I guess, them start getting used to the kennels. And then they get split up more and more and more. And then we, then we feed them, and then we, <laughs> then we clean up that row. <laughs> and then they grow. <laughs> <laughs> um, D. Din from Tennessee said, uh, love my Who reference, pictures of Lily. <laughs> what? Thanks. Not many people know that song for some reason. What song? Pictures of Lily. I'll play it for you after. Okay. Oh, dear. Thank God. It's like we had a Don't make him sing it, every man. <laughs> I can't sing it while we're on. Oh, good. Uh, <laughs> but you'll be privileged to hear it after we get off. Oh, isn't that wonderful? <laughs> Lucky you. I can hardly wait. I played a song by George Harrison that we had a staff thing after New Year's where we were putting together packages for, um, not, um, for like... You're going to get into more details. It started out to be about a song, right? It's all relevant. <laughs> anyway. I to do with the packages. We're putting together packages for charities. And I played this song for the staff. I mean, and it, it's a song that they play at New Year's every year, and nobody knew it. Nobody. Well, maybe knew. they've been at a different New Year's. I, I, maybe Chinese New Year's. Nobody knew it. I don't get it. It was. Sent, it, let me know if anyone knows it. It was "Ding Dong" by George Harrison. I, you don't know it? No. Oh. God. You're gonna have to okay. play a few songs. All right. We're gonna have. That's two songs we have to play. Yep. All right. Oh boy. <laughs> I can hardly wait. Joan, CP, what's the furthest location away you gave a Dane away? Well, I mean, the state of Well, we gave it. We gave it to her when she lived here, but she moved out to Washington. I used to wake up in the morning. I used to feel so bad. I got so sick of having sleepless nights. I went further, right? I'm trying to swing an arc. I would say further. I'm not sure. There's We've got Miami Utah. Ohio, We've though. got one in Utah. Do we have one in Utah? Um, Actually, the answer Casper to the question is, is I don't know. <laughs> is, are, is Casper in Utah, or is he somewhere out there? Um, somewhere out there. Casper lives in... One of those cowboy countries. I heard the microwave. I heard the microwave. Uh -oh. Would you focus, door. please? Focus, focus, focus. She is focused on that. <clears throat> Gail Frace, get the transponder number and the account number off of the bill, and then you can, we'll, we'll take care of it. Don't, thank you, Gail. Um, Lila May says, this is a good idea. You should get a vanity plate. Danes. What am I they, doing? Get a vanity plate, then you'll oh, that's remember a good it. Idea. That would be cool. It would be cool. It's also something the police can remember when they see you flying by at night. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good point. Yeah. I had one once. You get my, one of those James. My husband, my husband had MD one twenty eight for years, and then somebody else gave him number forty seven. 
So he wanted to put number 47 on his car, but he didn't want to give up the MD-128. So he put it on my little yellow Volkswagen, in which I delivered magazines. <laughs> so I'm down in Central Square in Cambridge, and I'm parked in the loading zone, which is correct, because I'm unloading magazines. And a meter maid came along, gave me a ticket, and I said, I'm, I'm delivering magazines. And she, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I moved across. I had three places to deliver. So I moved to the next one. She gave me another ticket. She gave me a third ticket. And I said, what the hell is going on? She said, I never yet saw a doctor's wife delivering magazines. I said, well, you have now. <laughs> And That's I had to pay the dip. No, I didn't sure. pay him. I went and objected. Yeah, I don't blame you. I also, another parking ticket story. <clears throat> I got a ticket for three parking places at once in Emerson Theater because I had that damn long trailer. Oh. <laughs> three parking places with the one trailer. Oh. That's all I know about tickets. <laughs> <coughs> um, um, Joan, what's the hierarchy dominance of the house dames? I know chaos is the top of the food chain. Me. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's true. Uh, they won't. They won't. They won't do too much if I'm here. I think they're all kind of on equal ground, anyway. Yeah. I mean, they, I, I, I say, uh -huh. different times, you know. allies are people with common enemies. Mm -hmm. They all look on me as the problem, so they're all fine. <laughs> <laughs> no comment. Anyway, <laughs> um, Barbara from Michigan, uh, Carleen, what are, what are the silly donkeys doing? Like what, all the donkeys. I don't know the, what they're doing. Uh, they're having a meeting. Having a well, meeting. except I've stopped putting hay out back so they'll be up front more. I don't like them out back there. Once in a blue moon, Carlene, I agree. We need a high school proficiency test for sign reading and following instructions. <laughs> Roxy's mom, how is Zena? Is she staying with Janine, her forever home? Question. No, mark. she came back. Apparently, <laughs> Wanda bit her up. <laughs> that was what. I, that's what I was told that Wanda started to fight with her. Jeez. Oh, <laughs> Apparently, I, it was when Janine wasn't home too. <laughs> so that was another problem. No. By OBC, I think strawberries are the only fruits with seeds on the outside. That's the only one I can think of that have the actual information. seed outside. Need confirmation. <laughs> um, Doris, did you return the new smaller Kubota tractor? I'm confused by something you said about getting a different tractor because you found out you couldn't get something worked on for several weeks. It was a riding mower. No, we still have it. I don't know when I said all that. I did... <laughs> Long ago, have a smaller Kubota, and I gave that to Lou Picard, which is also somebody who gets money from Explore. So I figured that was a legitimate transfer of whatever. Besides, it wasn't running too well. Her husband, she had a husband who could fix it. Um, but I bought this one, and then I just bought another smaller than the other. So I, I've had three Kubotas so far. We don't know why it's working. Bud and I talked about it last night. We don't know why it's working, so we're not going to touch any levers. <laughs> until we Let figure it, it out. Go. <coughs> Jody from Maryland. Thank you, Jody. Sent a uh, video and soundtrack of pictures of Lily. We'll watch it after. <coughs> um, um, okay. Um, picture of Dee Dee. Took a picture of Lilybug and, and posted it. And, and Kibitz from Arizona says she's one beautiful lady. She is a beautiful dog. Who's that? Lily. Oh, Lily. Lily, oh Lily. <coughs> um, um, B. Short says Linda K. should be careful with bronchitis. There's a virus going around again this year, and it's a bear to get rid of. It lasts. It's lasting about six weeks, and it's a two prescription illness. Oh. Debbie was diagnosed with flu B, type B, and she was wiped out for a couple oh. of weeks and it just really wiped out. Does it make you lose weight? That's yeah. What I, that's what I need. Yeah. I need one you of those. You don't want to be that sick. I, I need one of those bugs where you just feel miserable, you just don't even eat. Yeah. No. You, you don't <laughs> want, you, you don't want to get that. No. I, had a, I had an email today from 
somebody who explained to me that somebody's daughter had gotten an encephalitis problem from measles. Mm -hmm. Wow. I did not know that and died within hours. Wow. And they also, she, he also said that if they develop this encephalitis with the measles, there's nothing they can do about it. They will die. I did not know that about measles. No. I was just scratch and get over it. Um, <coughs> a lot of people posted about dogs in different parts of the country. Um, Lyle May says, good point, Carlene. Not sure which point she was referring to, but... He's saying something, <coughs> isn't he? He's mumbling. Mumble, mumble. What are you talking about, rabbit? Hmm? Was it rabbit or penny? I don't know. I cannot hear you. Was it rabbit or Bentley? <laughs> rabbit or Bentley did what? Mumbling. I thought it was you. Oh, I was mumbling. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> I thought it was. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, it's the time to get. It was you. <laughs> Oh God! Joan wants Joan wants to know if the slow cooker crock pot is still on the counter. Yes. Yeah, folks be able to see it. Yeah. Yeah, yes, it's over it there. It's right there. When your camera turns, you should be able to see it. And if it's not there, you're supposed to let me know okay. right away. Becky in Cal Becky in California. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. The seeds you see on the outside of a strawberry are actually the plant ovaries and are called. Achenes, 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 I guess. Each seed is technically a separate fruit that has a seed inside of it. Despite all this confusion about strawberry seeds, most strawberries are not actually grown from seeds. Becky, in California. Well, what the hell do you grow them from? Cuts. Cuts. Oh, the strawberries. And they're, they're yeah, runners. They're runners. So oh, they, so they, they spread. They spread. They, they root. Okay. Which came first? The seed of the rudder. Well, exactly. That's, you, you know? <coughs> okay, go ahead. We're off the strawberry department. Can we get on the food department? I again? think we're done. Are we done? I think we're done. Whoa! Thank you, everyone. Have a lovely weekend for anyone who's... Re who needs to have a Russia lovely weekend? A happy Pasha tomorrow. <laughs> and, um... See ya. Have a good weekend. Bye. Thanks, everyone. Bye, everybody. I'm going to turn this off now.